collective hey collective welcome back everyone thank you guys for watching my channel she's got the gift um collective excuse me um there there was a lot of messages i channeled for you so throughout this reading i will be dropping them please pay attention and if you guys can please decode these messages the best way you can that's what it's all about take what resonates please and leave the rest right on where it's at from this energy check-in um, if you guys are seeking something more personal, feel free to reach out to me. My website will be linked in this video down below in the description box. And if you guys are also interested in viewing new content from me, different content, different signs, my website to my Patreon will also be booked down below in this video, okay? We're going to jump right into it. Spirit, holy angels, I call upon you at this time for the collective angels. We need guidance. We need insight. Allow me clarity for that collective. Thank you for using me as a vessel. I'm grateful. Please continue to protect me, my foundation, and my family. Protect the collective, their foundation, and their family. Allow no weapon that's being formed to come against us to prosper, spirit angels. Return to sender, please. All black magic, evil entity, and spell work being sent. Thank you. All right, let's jump into it. Messages for the collective, spirit angels. Something about cherry pie. <laughs> I love your cherry pie. All right. That's the first message. Energy check in for the collective. Nine of Pentacles. A couple of you guys, even though you got everything going on and you're handling it, I get a feeling of overwhelmness too. Because the more stable you get, the more bills come. Because it's, it's some of you guys like the finer things in life. I could be talking to a Taurus. Earth sign in general here, Nine of Pentacles, Taurus energy. Show me more. Let go. All right. Well, I don't know what sign is tank, but they playing that song in my head. Oh, she found the number I had in my phone. I don't know it. Okay. Mm. You got the Nine of Pentacles here showing up as your strongest card out, the higher card in the middle of the deck. I mean, in the middle of your reading, the Nine of Wands here and the King of Cups. Somebody could be born in 99. This could be a sibling of yours, a child they talking about here. In specific, this boy could be, this child could be a boy. <laughs> Look, thank you, Spirit Angels. When they get to talking, they get to talking. Show me more about this Nine of Pentacles energy. Somebody is overwhelmed here. Insight on the Nine of Pentacles. Even though you can handle it, it's a bit much. Trying to get somebody here or to let their guard down is overwhelming to you. Trying to get somebody to open up or fighting hard for a person to see that you got their back and you're not going to portray them. Are you just here for them overall in general? It's hard for this person. Nine of Pentacles, Spirit Angels for the Collective. Somebody whose name is Bobby. You got the four cups here and the six of pentacles. I just said that. I just said that. Somebody is having a hard time trying to get somebody to see that they can confide in them. That I'm here for you no matter what. Six of pentacles, I always got your back. What I get, I'm definitely going to share with you. Or, you know, my money, my assets, whatever it is. If I can help you and be uh, a great <clears throat> asset in your life, then that's what I want to do. This could be somebody's child. But I feel like somebody is having a hard time. The four cups here. Opening up for what? I don't know. Uh, for a couple of you guys, this is giving me single energy too. So the first message here, this got something to pertaining to a child of yours, a sibling of yours, somebody that you take care of and look after financially in any type of way. It could be buying them food every now and then. It could be buying them a pair of shoes every now and then. It's just something that you do to take care of somebody. But yet they still giving you a hard time. I don't know if you're trying to get something out of this person. Or what it is, but somebody is like continuously giving you a hard time. It's a reason behind it, though, with this nine of wands. OK, now to the singles here, this got something to do with you feeling vulnerable for yourself, but also scared to to open up and be willing here to accept the new that the universe has for you. Show me more about this. The will of fortune. Mm. Fate, destiny is at play. The Empress here in reverse position. It could have came out upright. Let's see. I'm going to put it back and see if they want it back out. Empress here, though. Someone's mother. Oh, I just heard fall from grace. Uh, the side of my right ear, the back of my right ear. So this is your head. You could be feeling like a, a pain towards there or some sort of like stress.
or overall just a migraine in general, but it's only on one side of my head and it just started happening. Show me more spirit angels. Cherry pie again. The wheel of fortune here is upside down. There's something that you're not paying attention to. There's somebody you're not. There's something here. Uh, Page of Wands, though. Child, child energy. This is giving kid energy, y'all. Yeah, I don't know if some. Okay. Um, who is the four cup? Who is this? Who is who in this four cups? Good energy for the collector. Who is in this four cup cups energy? Who's the four cups? The hanged man. The ace of swords. Contemplating on speaking some sort of truth, okay? <clears throat> you got the hanged man here showing up, ace of swords showing up here, and the three of swords. Whoever this is that's in this four of swords, energy hang, uh, holding back from them or stagnant towards you, they contemplate that they want to come clean about something. Inside on the six of pentacles. Cherry pie. All right. Six of pentacles. Six of Wands. It's it's dest it's your destiny. It's faded for you to be known. It's faded for you to give back to your community. It's faded for you to have an impact on the world. Uh, you got the Queen of Swords here showing up. Uh, female energy. It's faded for a female energy to be exactly who she is. And this person gives back. This this person tributes. This person looks after people. It's got something to do with the Lord using you as a vessel. Putting you in some sort of position here where you're able to give, be an impact to people. Able to open up, feed them in any type of way. Give them a shirt here and there. It's not what you do. It's how you do it. And every little faith, every little uh, um act here of kindness and act on the Lord's here behalf is going to count for something collective. So whoever you are, kudos to you. Uh, one on the Wheel of Fortune. One on the Wheel of Fortune. It's got something to do with somebody you look at, look after, you take care of. You already said it in the beginning. Something is happening here with this person. They having a hard time opening up to you. The Wheel of Fortune here is clarifying with the moon in reverse position. So everything will definitely come to the light that was done in the dark. Period. Thank you. The higher font again. Taurus energy is here. Ten of swords here in reverse position. This is something that you're unaware of. But um, I feel like, too, you dodged the bullet. So if somebody here was having a hard time opening up to you or, or being real about whatever this is here that they battling, whatever type of truth this is over here with this hangman and ace of swords, three of swords, it could hurt you in some type of way. Are they even they are they either been hurt by this in some type of way? Either way it go is fated to happen with the will of fortune clarifying the moon in reverse position to the sword tier upright and the higher font. This is someone this you dodged a bullet. Show me on a higher show me the higher font on this energy right here, spirit angels. This person here could have a lot of per sex partners. This person here could sleep with a lot of people. If the four swords come out, you already know what's up. Hierophant, what's the lesson? What, what is to be taken serious for angels? Somebody here could be seeking, seeking lawyer, uh, getting lawyer advice. Somebody here could be going to see a doctor. Justice here. The law is involved in some sort. The tower here and the five of pentacles. Wow. So it's destined for this female energy here to blow up or be used as a vessel. And you know when you use as a vessel, you automatically rich in spirit, like, no matter what, you can feel like you down and you can feel like you ain't got enough. But the world around you, the people around you see you as being just who, they, who you are. A loving, caring, kind person here that is not scared to share. That money is a commodity too. And when it come, it go, it come, it go, it go, it come. The higher font here is clarified with justice showing up the tower and the five of pentacles. Whatever lesson this is to be taught, learned here. I don't know what they did to you. One on this, one on this three of swords. One on this three of swords, but this don't look good though. Something is blowing up. Somebody is gonna be homeless. Somebody house could be. I don't know. The three of swords. The lovers. Gemini energy. Definitely somebody you were sleeping with though, and a high priestess. Whew, we. A secret love affair. So somebody here has been whoever's been having a secret love affair. This is why they've been holding back from you. One on the ace of swords. Pisces energy is out here strong. Gemini energy is here. Taurus energy is here. And Libra. You got Scorpio showing up now too with the tower. One on the Ace of Swords. 
the the eight of cups here and the five of swords somebody walked away because somebody done something intentionally to hurt somebody so whatever this third whatever this other secret love affair is it was done intentionally to hurt you truth came out you walked away you already know what's up with the five of swords it's somebody consider it get back somebody playing tip for task somebody want to hurt you somebody want to see you down and out but the tables are turning and whoever this person is that's going through this shit is now seeing you here as the one that was always loving to them the one that was always opening up the one that was always caring and a lesson to be learned here now is to walk away without shit somebody here literally house could catch fire Some, something about somebody being homeless like that's their lesson that's their karma homelessness in the cups in reverse position family everybody uh everybody unhappy full of swords here showing up the devil in reverse position and the king of wands upright this is a masculine energy the female energy is being seen as being the real one and the masculine here is being seen as being a fuck boy don't nobody want to deal with him no more don't nobody want nothing to do with this person can't nobody help this person out this person is full of shit and he's showing up here as the king of wands Ace of Wands. What's this Nine of Wands? Inside on this Nine of Wands. Somebody here is going to have to work real hard to get out of something. Real hard to get out of something. Uh, the Nine of Wands is showing up with the Sun here, the King of Cups here, and the Page of Cups. This could be a, a Cancer coming towards you. But some sort of exposure, though. Whatever, whoever did, whatever this person here was working hard to keep you away from or working hard just to give to you in any sort of any sort of way. Now, again, you guys, because I they mentioned that in the beginning of the reading about you being this person that you have to take care of everything. But people don't know, you know, it's still overwhelming. And the more achieving you become, the more bills and the more shit that you got to pay for and the more you come out of pocket for stuff like that. A couple of you guys, this is your baby daddy that's going through this because they left you here to carry all of these burdens. And even though the shit look easy, it's real fucking hard. This person is running around here, running around town with different lovers here and secret love affairs here and don't care because they know that you're gonna feel some type of way about the person that they sleeping with but yet they still turn around and do it okay now this person here is, is something something here is like very mysterious about this reading somebody here is like literally left out in the cold i feel like you could blow up six of wands here six of pentacles out of nowhere for giving charity you know, they had them new them stories on the news every day. This woman used to give back or this man used to give back and never expected nothing out of it. Then boom, all of a sudden, God bless you with a hundred K, 500 K, a million. This is the type of, this is the type of vessel that you are. And somebody here took advantage of that. Somebody wanted to hurt you. Somebody didn't give a fuck about your feelings. And now they still, they still had choices here. Options to, to open up and tell you the truth. But somebody didn't, mm -mm, mm -mm. somebody here waited too long. They took too long to open up and tell you the truth on really what was going on here. You had to figure it out, find it out on your own. Somebody left you burden or left you an extra responsibility with a kid for a couple of you guys, a couple of kids, right? <clears throat> Even though you're still up and running, now it's time for somebody here to pay. Somebody here is going to be homeless. This is a lot of masculine energy out here. <clears throat> I asked who was in the Six of Pentacles here and the Six of Wands and the Queen of Swords popped out. So <clears throat> the stable one is the female. The one through, that's going through all of these uh, towers here is masculine. Show me more. Nine of, cup, nine of Wands here is clarified with the sun, some sort of exposure. King of Cups here and the Page of Cups. Show me more about this. Somebody, the secret lover here could have a baby by this person. You don't know it. You don't know nothing about it. Eight of Wands. What you're not seeing is you got your guard up towards this person, but I still feel like they come in Page of Cups here and the Page of Pentacles. Now they want to apologize here and now they want to start all over with you. Show me more. Is somebody here trying to dodge karma. They look at you here. They know that you're a vessel. They know it. Eight of Swords here in Judgment. A couple of you guys, when this do take place, because I feel like it has yet to do so with this page of pentacles here and this page of cups, this person here is destined for this person here. Like it's fated for this person to come back and try to get back into your good graces. And it's also fated for you to keep that shit pushing too. 
That's the way it's designed. That's the way it's set up here. That's the way your angels want this person to go out bad. They're going to come to you homeless and they're going to have nothing. They're going to apologize and want to come back in. And <clears throat> by glory to God, you, you make the right decision. Show them on this King of Cups right here. You got a King of Cups here showing up over here and then a King of Cups over here. Masculine uh, Cancer for a couple of y'all. It could be a Scorpio masculine. Capricorn energy is out here. Cancer, Scorpio, Capricorn, Libra, Taurus, Pisces, Gemini. Inside of this King of Cups. The Magician, Gemini energy again, Virgo energy. The Magician, the Four of Wands here, and the Temperance. Divine intervention is at play with somebody. Divine intervention is at play in this masculine's life. So everything he feeling, y'all see how my voice closed up too. Everything he feeling, <clears throat> as far as his emotions, and uh, it's, it's, designed, it's designed that way. Excuse me, y'all, let me go because they stopping me. Advice for the collective. <clears throat> Advice for the collective. There ain't nothing in my throat. I drank too much tea. Advice, the five of swords here, the five of wands. Five, five, five is out here. 55 is out here too. Five of swords, five of pentacles, and the spread. Yeah, somebody here is going through a change that they don't want to go through. Somebody here is like being seen. Somebody here is homeless now. Something that they did on you. Something that they don't want to open up to to you. Like, this is two stories here for sure. One with a child that's scared to open up about something. About this masculine energy here. And then there's another person here. Another masculine energy here. That's going through these towers back to back to back. And they like starting to realize here. The hanged man. That sudden realization kicking in. It was never. It was never Taurus. It was never Scorpio. It was never Libra. It was never Cancer. It was never Gemini. It was such and such. That was manipulating me. And mind fucking me. Into not seeing who my real person was. Not seeing or, or to. My mind manipulating me and mind fucking me to dislike and distreat and discredit my soulmate, my partner, my twin. Um, but your advice is the five of swords here and the five of wands. Competition ain't nothing on you. It's not what you do, it's how you do it though, because they're giving me this type of energy by this being your advice. You continue to keep your head, you could keep you continue to keep your head on your on a swivel, continue to keep your foot on a neck, and always know here daily that you wake up. If you fight off one person, that don't mean another motherfucker ain't trying to climb his way to the top. And by climbing his way to the top, that means they're going to step on any and everybody to get there. When one door is shut and you complete something, another one opens, okay? So keep your eyes open, period. I'm leaving it there, Collective. I hope you guys like this. I hope this was in sight that you needed. Um, If you got any type of peace, okay? Don't forget to hit the like, the comment, and subscribe button. Until next time, peace.